What up, everybody? It is Rhino. Welcome back. MLB 15, the show road to the show with our creative pitcher, Dan. And it's still not traded. It's very unfortunate. We got nothing going down there. Sweet. Now we can just... I feel bad the fact that those things are negative one. It kind of annoys me. So we're gonna do a little bit of a tidying up there. Can't do that. We can do this, though. Oh, just... So you know what? Shabams. There we go. We're going to ask for a trade again. Because the fact that they're like, oh yeah, woo woo. We got you, bro. We got you. And they ain't got me. Really annoys me. Really annoys me. I'm not a fan. Send me to Oakland. Even though they have the same exact record. 347, 357. Okay, don't send me there. Like, apparently my team's getting freaking runs, but not uh not for me. Damn sure not for me. Ain't doing nothing for me. Okay, that's great. We have four ninths, almost a half of my lineup is cold, but almost half of their lineup is cold as well. So that's a plus. That is a plus. Yeah, 264 batting average. Doubt it. Eighth in RBIs. Doubt it. I don't believe that at all. I don't believe that at all. You're getting that for show. Friday night baseball now from the Friday night baseball in Minute Maid Park. In Houston. Tonight it's the first of four. And then briefly let's take a look Oh my god, we gotta run. Pitchers you get the assignment here. It's a miracle. We'll step in now to lead things off in the home half of the first. The really dude freaking You're gonna swing at the first pitch? Right back. Extra bases oh dead. Run. Goodbye. Thank you very much. Out at second base. Probably should have stayed right where he was. Empty here with one away, and that'll bring in the shortstop Jed Lowry. He'll start him with a breaking ball, too low that time. It's ball one. Yeah, those are the ones you like to start in that bat, especially your first time up. I agree. Give me a nice, easy one in the dirt that I can take so I can really get ahead in that count early. Bases are empty, one man out. Here comes a one two. Swing and oh, let it do. He's a strikeout victim here, two away. Did that just say he's hitting 234? That is not Jose Altuve material. And here's a fastball called for strike one. One and one. You gotta figure that that man right there would be more than happy to see this guy at the plate taking his swings with two out and nobody on all night long. Well, yeah, he's kind of good. I mean, granted, he's hitting 230 in this friggin' thing, but. Splitter, but he started it too low as it bounces up to the plate. Later, dude. Swung on and missed for strike three, and the inning is over. More runs. Yeah, look at this. Chris Carter. Look at this. Now, one home run shy of 20 for the season so far. Nowhere close with the fastball to begin the at bat. It's ball one. Now a check swing, but it's strike one anyway, says the home plate umpire. Yeah, and it's tough enough to hit 95-plus mile-an-hour fastballs. That curve gives you something else to think about altogether. Yeah. And a splitter here, but he had a bit too much on it as this bounces up to the plate. And with the tying run in the on-deck circle, question, does there we he go. take a look at another one here? He just might. You're still going to see a good pitch on three and two, even if this one's a strike. Oh, you got it, you got it, you got it. There we go. I had him beat just in case. Ooh, Evan Gaddis is not doing good on the road. Lucky for him, we're in Houston. No chance, and that's what you got. 
Up against a machine too strong. Something politicians. Blah, 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 blah. Puppets. You've got no chance, Jim. No chance in hell, you've got no chance, Jane. Fouled back. Evan. Stop it. Alright. Stop it. Now here's another pitch fouled off and heading for the seats, and he's just fighting to stay alive here, still two and two. The oh, there we go. Let's do it. So he'll need to get the force at first. And indeed, the throw will finish him off as they get the put out at first. And there are two away now. Hey, George Springer. Springer. George Springer. Now, trying to get something started with two away. Here. George Springer. George Springer. Strike two on the curveball. Oh, and two. You relate to Jerry. I'm there to that curveball. I think that's exactly where he's going to want to throw that pitch going forward. It wasn't. It wasn't even close to where I want to throw that pitch going forward. snap on that pitch in the future. Let's go, kid. Here we go. Nope. Oh. Yeah, well, he didn't catch on to my pattern, so shove it. We played Another run? Full. No, you guys suck. I got it. Big slow breaking ball that drops in for a strike to start him out. It's nothing and one. Oh, that's gone. Oh! But that'll be off the Warning track power. And he'll pull in there with a one out double. Wowzers. Luis Valbuena. Valbuena. Now a fastball, a bit too low here. It's ball one. Well, you see there on the graph, the double is his eighth of the season so far. Here's the 1-1. One, one. And he takes ball two, and it's two and one. He's ready. Now the pitch. And this is hit hard on the ground. All right. And two outs. The for the out. No worries. The runner will move up 90 feet to third base. Just need to get Venable. Mr. Venable out. There we go. I like it. Good job, boys. Good defense. Is it bad that I've gotten this game like countless years in a row and I still have no idea which one is Eric Karros and which one is Steve Lyons? I don't have a freaking clue. I have no idea which voice is theirs. This is clearly Matt Bass. Like, we know that. That one's easy. And a pitch in the dirt as he lays off. It's one and one. All right. On the outer half. One and two now. Now here's the pitch. To two balls and two strikes now. Now the pitch. And he just manages to stay alive. Jose, you're killing me. This one foul. Just stop it. The two, two, one more time. Bouncing ball oh, okay, that went over me. Whatever. On to Davis I'll take first, it. And there are two away. I'll take it. Chris Carter will stand in. He grounded out his first time. In there, 0-1. Oh, oh, that is a nice pitch right there. You kind of slow it down and give him that big breaking ball to start off the at-bat. 
Make sure he's not a guy that's looking to ambush that first pitch fastball. And a fastball. Later, dude. That was an awful pitch, but I'll take it. Evan Gaddis stands in to start things out here in the home half of the fifth. And you get the sense, Steve, that this crowd's been pretty well taken out of the ballgame to this point. Yeah, they pretty much had to sit on their hands all afternoon. Not a lot to get excited about so far. And I think that's a credit to that man out there on the mound. He's cut right through this lineup for the first four innings. That's me. They're talking about me. The Kentucky Derby! Later, dude. If I had a horse, his name, and like, in, he was going to be racing and whatnot. For like the Kentucky Derby, his name would totally be later, dude. And here it is, it's the finish, it's later, dude. Oh. Sticking with the soft stuff here as this misses, it's two and one. Yes, strike, yes, strike. That's not a strike. That's a hit. That's the opposite of what we want. Okay. No, let it do. Going for the splitter. Jason Castro will stand in here. He doubled his first time around. Low with the splitter, ball one. He's ready now, the pitch. Fastball got him to swing through it. It's one and one. And sometimes you got to cut down a little stride against a guy who's throwing this hard. Either you take that leg kick completely out of the equation, Ooh, or you get started that. just a little bit quicker. Breaking ball misses the corner. Two balls and two Looper. strikes. And that's lifted in the air at But it's caught. And he'll get there in plenty of time to put this one away, and that ends the inning. Five innings have been no problem as he's got the shutout working. Now the first pitch. Ball hit high and foul down the left. And probably not catchable. Yep. Now here we saw Buena. Oh my goodness, foul the other way. Later, dude. He ran the fastball right by him for the first out. One away for the Astros here in the sixth. And standing in now, the left handed hitting Will Venable. And now a right hander up and throwing in the Baltimore bullpen. Why? Down and away, one ball and no strikes. And 2 0 as this one's taken. Is it because I have 70 pitches? No runs, three hits. No errors. Because they don't have faith in me? Astros to this point. Oh, and he couldn't help Thanks, bro. He swings and misses at a pitch really appreciate that. Two and one now. Boy, that changeups had him eaten out of his hand. Oh, and they've been falling all over themselves trying to get it. But you just got to know that that's not going to be a Later, strike. dude. It looks like it is, but it is. That was a perfect and curve. Strikeout number eight now in the ball game for him. Jed Lowry will dig in for the third time now. He struck out and bounced out in his first two trips. And a fastball's in there for strike one. And that's in there as well. 0-2 oh, now. Now here's the pitch. And that's swung okay. on and fouled straight back. Okay. So we're going to go back up there and see what happens. Oh, oh hey now. The plate that time. Some mind games being played now. It's one and now we are here. Let it, dude. Perfect. Perfect. Home run. Good job, Grandel. Good freaking job. And here's a fastball called for strike one. He continues to get ahead here. He's been in complete control. Ooh, nice stop. Nice play, bro. Right-hander throwing in the Baltimore bullpen. Chris Carter is at the plate as he looks at ball one. 
And even though he's pitching well, this is a part of the order that he's really got to worry about. They can turn it. It's alright, just a single. No big deal. No big deal. Evan Gaddis will dig in now. Hitless in his two at bats so far. Oh, that one's gone. Nope, it's gonna be caught. He's not running. Pulling it in out there is Cespedes, and there are two gone now. Okay. Got two outs. Just need to get the out. And we'll be good to go. That's hit hard on the ground and it'll ah, you bastard. into right field for a two out single. And that runner will go no further than second as there are two aboard now. Colby Rasmus will step in now as his guys look for a breakthrough here with a runner in scoring position. Yeah, that's been a long time coming. They haven't done anything with their opportunities so far. And maybe well, good. Let's keep it that way. Now he turns on one and nice, Davis. Good job. And we escape. We escape. Going back out. Well, that man right there is into his eighth inning of work now. Any concerns going forward? Well, you have to worry about is that pitch count you see right there. Other than that, he's earned the right to stay out there. Usually the other team will tell you when you're starting to get tired. Here comes another 0-2. Oh, there the dude. So double digits now, 10 strike Number 10. Now action in the bullpen as their closer starts to get loose out there. Big roundhouse curveball in there for strike one. Yet again, another first pitch strike. And it's a big reason of why he's having the success he is. You establish the count in your favor right away, and it just opens up the door to so many more options going forward. And caught. I like it. What's that number two? Put it away, and there are two guns. Yeah. Will Venable will stand in now with two away, needing to really get something started here. And their chances of getting back into this ball game are growing dimmer by the batter. Now a splitter starts things off with a called strike one. Now the 0-1 pitch is swung on and hit out to Desmond. At short. There we go. And eight innings have come and eight shutout innings. The inning is over. Joe Thatcher. I like it. Now to start the ninth inning as he looks to keep this deficit. Oh, right they're sending me out. The bottom of the ninth. Sending me out. We'll be tasked now with leading things off in their half of the ninth. Try See what I can do. And whatever they've done for the first eight innings hasn't yielded a whole lot so far. So, quite frankly, I'm not expecting too much. This is swung on and lifted down the left field line, but it'll get back into the crowd as he jumps ahead of him now. 0 and 2. And he Later, dude. Out. That was right down the middle too. Come on now. That's his third strike out of the ball game. That was right down the middle. Jose Altuve will stand in, needing to do something here to get on base as they're down to their final two outs. Yeah, we see a lefty and a right-hander start to loosen up in the bullpen. Fouled straight back. And now a pitch on the way. Taken the other way. Pop up. Be routine out Catchable. Right field. Martinez. Caught. Is there one more out? Two are gone here, and it's not looking good for the home nine. Chris Carter will stand in now as their last shot here with two away in the ninth. Yeah, just one final hurdle here before he finishes off the shutout. Drops in a strike to start the at bat. Nothing in one. Ball one. The pitch. And this will be a called strike two. And trouble now as they're down to their final strike tonight. Yeah, and that fastball still got some life to oh. it. Oh. I was ready for it. I was ready for it. Full count now. Three Screw you, bro. Well, you Screw you. Hot looking on the final out. So that's a tough pitch to lay off. Ah. And that one's taken outside that's the ump's fault. So no one, two, three, and here I had the high fastball. That was a strike. Two 
out with the man at first. Now a ball hit in the air. To and that one's gone. This is carrying well out of here. There goes the shutout. There goes the complete game. That was the win, though. That was that high fastball was a strike. The ump screwed me over. I'm be like, Buck, that ump is a dick. He is a dick. That's upsetting. That's upsetting. But we gotta win, so we'll take it. And guys, that is where we end this episode. Thank you very much for watching. I sure hope you enjoyed. Remember, leave a like, leave a comment, subscribe if you guys want to see more, and I will see you next time. Peace.